lab guy here. Uh, just another quick video. Uh, I was uh, watching some uh, rock polishing videos last week and just a couple of days ago one of the channels that I enjoy called Tess9991 was demonstrating cutting open uh, rock with silver ore and he had a giveaway and I was a uh, third place winner and I got a chunk of rock and so he and I began speaking and uh, he's located in Toronto and I'm in Silicon Valley he's sending me the the silver and a couple of other minerals and I asked him about radioactives and he uh, said there was some around there and I offered to give him a Geiger counter or at least a radiation detector it's not a counter and this is a small kit made by Cheney. It's called the C8600. And it is a, a simple step up, voltage step up circuit and a little audio amplifier. Uh, it runs on a 9 volt battery and works with a number of uh, Geiger counter tubes, miniature Geiger counter tubes. So I assembled the kit, as you can see here, and attached a small Russian surplus Geiger counter tube to the board and uh, we'll now power it up and give it a test All right, you want to be careful not to touch the ends of the tube uh, the, there's a 555 timer and a transformer with a diode and a filter capacitor to charge up the uh, Geiger counter tube which runs at hundreds of volts I think this one runs between 300 and 500 volts somewhere I, I don't know the particulars so Let's uh, take my uraninite ore, my uranium ore, and see if it works. And we'll place that right up against the tube. Like that, and as you can see, it's detecting radiation. I also have a couple of uh, small radium painted clock hands, watch hands. And these two are mildly radioactive. There's a little more radiation than you see, but because the bottle is a certain thickness of glass, as is this tube, the, much of the radiation is actually being shielded by the glass. I'm checking to see if one end is more sensitive the other, than the other, and it appears it is. This plus end. And there you go. A Geiger counter. Uh, some uranium ore, an hour of my time to assemble it. Pretty cool. We live in great times. Don't let anyone tell you otherwise. Lab guy out.